I don't know you guys, like I was driving this week at work and I started feeling like I wasn't really close to God. But we're going to be talking about that. But if you're wanting to get stronger in your relationship with the Lord, you want to get God muscle, you might want to consider subscribing to this channel because that's what it's intended to do. It could be, you guys, like for me, actually after I started thinking about it, um, I started realizing that I was so busy doing all these things and having, having all these things going on that I wasn't really paying attention to God. You know, and I found this verse in the Bible. It's actually in James chapter four, verse eight. And it says this, it says, draw near to God and he'll draw near to you. It says, draw near to God and he'll draw near to you. It doesn't say draw near to God and he might draw near to you. It doesn't say, you know, if you draw near to God, sometimes he'll draw near to you. It says like, if you draw near to God, he'll actually draw near to you. So what we might want to do sometimes is, number one is we might want to turn off the TV, you know? Number two is, we might want to put our cell phones down. Okay, number three, you know, like if I'm super busy, I might need to just kind of go into my room and close the door and open up the Word of God, you know, because I want to connect with Him. He says, if you draw near to me, I'll draw near to you. You know, it's like He's there the whole time, just waiting for us to turn back around and to notice Him. Hey guys, and it's not always about a feeling, you know, like, you, you hear people say like, I, well, I don't feel close to God. I used to say that. Maybe if I didn't spend time with the Lord, I'd be like, I don't feel close to Him, but it's not about a feeling, it's about faith, it's about knowing that He's there. No, despite what we feel, we can't go by our senses. I know that you know we have all these five or six senses, whatever we have, but we can't go by those when it comes to the Lord. Like we, It's a knowing, it's a knowing deep within your heart. It's a knowing that He's there. That's true, guys. And I think, though, too, like sometimes, you know, if we feel like we've done something wrong, maybe we sinned or we've come short, you know, sometimes that'll get us to where, you know, we want to kind of turn our backs and be like, man, we're just not, I just don't feel good enough for the Lord. But you know what? God, I feel like just God's just like saying like, hey, even though you sin, you're doing stuff that's wrong, turn around, come and face me, come near to me, and we can work through this. I want to work through this with you. And you know, God, God's grace is so profound that and it's been true in my life that the times that I felt maybe, I know it's not about a feeling, but maybe I felt unworthy or felt furthest from God, He's actually used me the most and I just don't understand His grace. Like, that's who, that's the God we serve. Like, even if you have a bad day or, you know, you, you feel like unworthy or you feel like you don't really measure up, like, it's so amazing that God would still use us. It's just, it's mind baffling to me. So you guys remember, it's not always a feeling, I don't feel close to God. You know, it's not a, 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 a list of requirements, I've got to do this and that in order to draw near to God, but... Just do what the Word says. So if you are feeling like, hey, I'm feeling far, even though we said it's not a feeling, or, you know, do what the Word says, draw near to God, and He's going to draw near to you. Like, that's His Word. His Word is so, um, it doesn't return void, it's faithful. He's faithful in His Word, so... You know, you do your part and he's going to meet you. You know, you guys, if you guys want to post anything in there, if you got anything to say about this, man, we'd like to hear it. You know, if not, dude, Jesus loves you and his unconditional love and grace is for you 24-7.